Hey, what's going on everyone? This is iReviews back with another video and today we're talking about iOS 19. Now I know we're months away from the release of the first beta of iOS 19 and even more months away from the release of iOS 19 to the public, but we do have some information regarding this update. So in this video, I will share with you guys everything that we know regarding iOS 19 until now. Now, first of all, the code name for iOS 19, as you might know, Every software that Apple is currently working on does have a code name and the code name for iOS 19 is Luck. Now all these information come from Mark Grumman who is our very trusted source when it comes to Apple related stuff. Now according to Grumman, the gradual release of iOS features are pushing back the planned features for iOS 19. So as you see with iOS 18, Apple is actually taking quite a lot of time to release the new features. Even with iOS 18.3, we'll still have to wait for 18.4 to actually get all the major features that Apple is planning to release with iOS 18. So we have to wait at least here until April 2025 to actually get the full potential of iOS 18, the full features which are expected to come here with iOS 18.4. And that is pushing away also the iOS 19 features. Now, according to Mark Grumman, this will slow down the release for also iOS 19. So according to him, iOS 19 might happen to also be completed in spring 2026. So all the big new features of iOS 19 should be released until iOS 19.3 or even 19.4. So that's basically the same thing as iOS 18. Keeping in mind again that the release of the big new features of iOS 18 is going kind of slow, that will actually make the release of big new features for iOS 19 also go really, really slow. Now, Apple has begun working on a new feature on iOS 19, which is the new LLM based Siri. Basically, a Siri that works something like ChatGPT, basically a chat bot. So, chatbot a series chatbot something like this so according to grumman apple has been working on it and it should be here with ios 19 but it should be on early 2026 most likely 19.3 somewhere around the end of january of course this will be basically typing to siri in, in a new way which siri will be able to handle back and forth conversations which actually is pretty awesome and not just like the current way when you tap to siri way all you have to do is just ask question but again you can make a conversation just like chat gpt now another thing we do know regarding iOS 19 is that all the current devices that support iOS 18 will also support the new iOS 19 so that's really cool. You can see the list here from the newer devices up to the oldest ones so you will be able to actually install iOS 19 on the iPhone 11, 11 Pro and the 11 Pro Max and the 10s right there. 10s max and you can see the xr as well and of course the se series 2 and 3 which is again amazing this has been reported from a lot of sources and if it turns out to be true it will actually be amazing so when can we expect ios 19 to be released well the first beta most likely will be right here june the second usually the first monday of june is the day that apple starts wwdc and it should be right here june the second after the conference you can expect the first beta of ios 19 to be released to the devs probably towards the middle of july right here we will have the first public beta of ios 19 and then somewhere here around the 15th or maybe even the 22nd of september we should have ios 19 released to the public again all this based on the previous years and how apple usually does things so that's basically it for this video guys this is everything we know until now regarding the upcoming ios 19 hope you guys enjoyed the video smash that like if you did subscribe for more and i'll see you on the next one.